Well, her future undeniably is in the UFC Hall of Fame. Her present is making the walk tonight, the former UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion, Rowdy Ronda Rousey, one of the biggest superstars this sport has ever seen. Nine career wins by submission, all of them by arm bar. More often than not, it is a quick night at the office for the wildly talented former Olympic judoka, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey was a bronze medalist in the Olympics in judo and has one of the best arm bars in the history of combat sports. Well, as many of you know, she knocked out Ronda Rousey in emphatic fashion at UFC 193 back in 2015 to become the undisputed UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion, Holly Hall, for a long time atop boxing's pound-for-pound -pound list, now trying to continue her ascent in the Ultimate Fighting Championship. This girl has a ridiculous chin, and a chin like hers is such an amazing asset to have. She can take shots, she has massive confidence in her ability to take shots, and she stays in the pocket and lands big bombs with her counter strikes. All right, just about ready for live action. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. Rousey is 28, Holm is 36. The rest is nearly identical. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, he's looking. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It is Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, no losses. She stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Venice Beach, California, presenting the former UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion of the World, Now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a boxer, holding a professional record of 12 wins, four losses. She stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Holly, the preacher's daughter. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to I am home. very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is gonna go ready? down right now. Fight. We are ready to go with round one here. Oh! oh! with that punch, you gotta shore up the defense here. And lands a good shot. Well, this is exactly what you like to see. Nice combination of ground and pound punches. Outstanding pressure and activity by Hall. Rousey gets hit flush with that overhand, and that one hit hard. Damaging punch lands for her there. Strike here to end the fight early in the first.
Yeah, Joe, how about the knockout there? Beautiful technique to land the fight ending shot. And again, we're a broken record when it comes to this, but sometimes when you catch a fighter cold, maybe before she's had a chance to get herself into the fight, that strike can have a bigger effect. It certainly did here tonight. Take a look at this from a different angle. Bang. And there she is after the massive knockout. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Here's Bruce Buffer with Ladies the official the decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At one minute, 21 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Holly the Preachers So your winner tonight, Holly Holm, the preacher's daughter. She's been a little bit up and down in her UFC career. She was certainly up here tonight. And we have seen an uptick in the aggression out of Holly Holm, dating to that Misha Tate fight that was certainly on display here tonight. And when Holly Holm fights like this, she looks like she could be a two-division UFC champion. She won the belt, obviously, at 135.